know I'm gonna say this and I'm gonna take it back. The bloggers, this is the part you want. I love my man so much, right? I love him so much. And y'all might, this might be too deep for y'all. I'm going too deep now. I ain't never caught my man cheating. I've What's never going cheated. on, heavy hitters? Welcome to Heavy Hitter Media, where we love to read, rant, and review. Recently, Dr. Henley was online preparing for this week's Merits and Medicine episode. And of course, kind of talking about what happened throughout the week with Sweet Teeth. Um, baby, this woman says, I ain't never known my man to cheat as far as I know. And she also says some other really interesting stuff. So let's go ahead and take a listen. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Meet me in the comments and let's do what we do. Y'all, come on, let's do it. Let's have this heavy conversation and talk heavy about hitter it. Media. Did you or did you not tell Sweet Tea that Dr. Damon cheated? You know what, I don't even wanna talk about this girl no more, but you already know the answer. Pause me, please. Dr. Heavenly, yes or no? <laughs> Listen, I'm going to say this and I'm going to take it back. I ain't never caught my husband cheating. I've never But do, can I say 100% my man ain't cheated? No, you can't. Nobody can say that. My mama used to say all men cheat, right? But if he did, would I tell freaking sweet tea? That's the question that, that you answered your own question. Why would I tell her that? I wouldn't tell her that. No, he is not cheating on me that I know of. Pause me, please. Thank you, Dr. Heavenly, for finally saying no. Because I listened to her live, well, that portion, and she did not say that you told her he cheated. She said that when Mariah allegedly said what she said, that you were potentially scared. And she said, so that would lead her to believe that he cheated. She never said you said it. Folks just going to believe and take what they want. And it's a lazy read, actually, because it's already been done. I didn't see the video, but it's already been done. Mariah did it to the umpteen. She did it with skill set. Well, speak on it. Okay. So this right here, anyway, and I'm going to tell you how I feel about it at the reunion so I can say it to her face. That's what I'm going to do about that. Pause me, please. Baby, do you know how bad I cannot wait to the reunion? Do you know how bad Dr. Heavily is going to obliterate and totally annihilate Sweet Tea? And some of y'all talking about Dr. Heavily done met her match. Child, all that cursing and neck rolling and looking like you 12. She could never. I don't give a damn. I really don't. I really don't. And I'm going to tell y'all one day how I really feel. Honestly, I know I'm going to say this and I'm going to take it back. The bloggers, this is the part you want. Honestly, I'm thinking I love my man so much. If he wanted some ass, if he wanted some ass, I'd buy him some. I love my man. <laughs> Pause me, please. Well, y'all heard it here. Baby, this woman love us some Dr. Damon Daddy, honey. Hit me in the chat, in the comments. What y'all think about it? What are your thoughts about what she just said? Yeah, but if that's what he wanted, if I feel like I'm all my husband ever wanted and needed, but if he wants some ass, it's just ass. I, 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 I get it checked out. I get it. You know what I'm saying? Make sure it's, you know, ain't disease. You know, if he wanted some ass, I love my man enough to make him happy, baby. If this all you want? Oh my gosh. So that's why I say I don't think my man would cheat because if he wanted it, we talk about it and I'd be like, is this what you want? I would never open the door, and I'm glad that he does not want that, and I'm glad we never had that conversation, but I just love my man so much. Oh, I love it. You know what I mean? I buy him some ass. I can afford it. You know what I'm saying? So, my man ain't out there on the blogs with other women. I, let me stop, because I said I wasn't going to go negative today. But when you start saying that kind of stuff about the infamil, and I don't even know what she said about the infamil. Pause me, please. She said, explain why you got that infamil and why you hiding them grandbabies. But I don't think you hiding grandbabies because if the fathers, or if the fathers were going to say your oldest son don't want them on TV, you respect their wishes, if that's the case. But they're going to start looking up your shit, little girl, and you don't want that because it's, you know, it's some shit out there. Let me just say that. All right? All right, heavy hitters, y'all be sure to check out my previous and other videos. Be sure to hit like, comment, and subscribe, and share my videos. Really, really appreciate y'all. We're on the road to 2000, and I really, really appreciate y'all. Child Dr. Heavily knows she can say some stuff that just make you say, hmm, her and Dr. Damon Daddy appear to be happy. They put on that they're happy, so all we can do is believe that they're happy. They have amazing children who are all college graduates, professionals. I'm sorry, two college graduates who are professional men, and their youngest is now in college and they have successful businesses. So whatever they're doing, it apparently works or it appears to work. All right, y'all, until the next time, y'all be easy. Peace. You are now twerking to heavy intermediate. You are twerking, twerking, twerking.
Come on back and let's have this heavy conversation.